Hi guys, my name is Courtney and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to curl your hair without heat. So if you want to know if I curl all this hair without heat, then just keep on watching. Alright guys, so first, split the hair like this. And I comb it. Through like this. And I make sure it's even on both sides. Then you want to actually dampen the hair with a spray bottle before you start to do it. If you just come out of the shower, you can do that too, but my hair dries, so I'm just going to dump it in with a spray bottle so I the ends. Because I naturally have pinched straight hair, like the hair you're seeing, this is my natural hair, so it's nice to put a little bit of curl and some body in it without having to use heat all the time. Alright, now what you want to do is you want to take this row, you can use any row you like, and put it on like the middle of your head. Evenly on both sides. take your bangs and I like to have a lot of body in my bangs so I put them straight up and I start them really really high otherwise my bangs will be really flat Done. As you can see, I've really just twisted my hair down the road. I come closer, but my hair is so long, I don't think you can see all in the picture, so hopefully you can see it okay. I'm just twisting them. The smaller ones you do, the smaller the curl is going to be, and the thicker chunks of hair you put around the world, the bigger the curls are going to be. I like bigger and looser curls, but it's up to you. You can do it however you like to have it. I'm just going to add a little bit more dampness to this. Okay. On the last strand, just gonna wrap around. You can also do this with socks as well. I never tried it with socks because my hair is so long, but my sister actually uses socks and it works really good for her. My sister is actually the one who showed me this, and I'm so glad she did because I'm a, I've been obsessed with it ever since. So now all my hair on one side is done. And I'm gonna take a black little elastic and I'm just gonna wrap 
wrap it around that bottom here. Like so. Now as you can see, I do have a little piece of hair sticking out. And all I do is wrap it around. And I take a little bobby pin. And I just make sure I wrap it around. And I use the bobby pin to secure it. Alright, that's one side done. Now let's go for the other side. And the side's drying pretty quick. So it's gonna have a bit more water. And I find that this works best with clean hair. So that's just another little bit. So again, I'm starting my bangs pretty high on the low. And then I'm just wrapping them around. Another thing I love about this hairstyle too is your hair looks so shiny and pretty. Like, it looks shinier than it would with a normally curler, even when you put oil in it. It just looks so beautiful. So. The one in your hair looks super shiny and pretty and bombshell like. This is just so pretty. Again, I'm just wrapping the hair around the row, like so. And this hairstyle does take practice too, so be patient. You'll figure out what you like and what you don't like and how you like to do your curls. So even if you don't like it the first time, give it another try because I really do think this technique's worth learning because it's it's so beautiful and it takes no heat and no damage to your hair. And it lasts for two to three days, so. Why not, you know? I'm just gonna stick it on my hair. And then I'm going to take another little black elastic and just put it around the bottom of that hair to keep it in place. Just turn it up right here. Just going to secure that in place. Bobby pin like so. So now I got both sides. Um, and I'm glad this actually happened on camera just so you can see. Sometimes if you don't wrap your big pieces tight enough, they will completely get loose. So I'm actually just going to quickly redo this side. Alright guys, so both sides are done. As you can see. Now what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to take these both back and twist them. is take my makeup off and brush my teeth and get ready for bed and I can't wait to show you guys how it looks in the morning. I'll see you guys in the morning. Bye. Alright guys, good morning and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be taking these curls out. So I'm going to start from behind and I'm just going to take this elastic out that's separating. 
Now I have my two braids here, and we're just gonna take them out. I'm just gonna make some coffee. And yeah. So first I'm gonna take out each bobby pin. It's securing my hair, and then I'm just gonna gently take out my elastics. Be careful because they can sometimes get tangled. Okay, one. Slowly around that curl. Just be gentle. You can see the like little ringlets. And then just be gentle with your bangs because they sometimes get really stuck around the waist. Create so, yeah. any tangling or roughness. Alright guys, so we're just going to take out this side now. Starting at the bottom. are bigger and the bigger chunks you curl with the better or the bigger the curls will be it just depends on whatever you like but this hair will completely fall out by the end of the day obviously you can brush it out as well comments down below like this video if you liked it please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one bye